So hello guys and welcome here to a new video and today we are going to have a quick look at Hyperwave because if you're unaware they did their season 1 air drop and the checker finally is now available. So first of all we are going to check our allocation regarding Hyperwave and for the main wallet we actually got 1260 token which is not bad if you consider that we only started farming in the last few weeks of the first season. I'm honestly not really sure exactly when we started because it's only on a week to week basis but it looks like we only participated for one month and if that's the allocation that we got that's for sure not bad because we did not really participate with much and even so if we would for example check our second wallet we even participated with less funds but still we're able to get 103 tokens which of course is not the world but then again do that with a few wallets here and there and then you pretty much are going to accumulate a lot of tokens and the key on doing so is by doing YT positions and YT positions there's currently two <coughs> one where you can uh, supply the stablecoin version which is the HLP and one where you can supply the Hyperwave HL uh, not the HLP the Hyperwave um, a staked version of the token itself which gives 50 points per one HW hype that you do have each and every day and you get one point per one HW HLP per day meaning <coughs> that again depending on your preference you can either go ahead and choose usdc meaning the stablecoin of uh, hlp which is the hyperwave one or you are going to choose the hype version which uh, i also had for a really short term because it skyrocketed a lot in price and i immediately sold it for profits now i'm waiting again on a good entry price how can you look into an entry price, looking into implemented APY as well as the underlying APY is important because the price will be reflected based on again the interest in the underlying token and currently it looks like it's going down a bit with cooling off from the season 1 hype. Again that is the perfect moment to go ahead and purchase. Now talking about the points and what it could be worth, I hope <coughs> this is accurate, I'm not 100% sure, I just had a look at it and it was posted in the Hyperwave Discord, so I honestly could imagine that it is actually correct. And here we have a few different uh, scenarios, one with 10 million and 50 million for example, and if the protocol would have a fully diluted valuation of 10 million, one token would be worth one cent and five cent at 50 million which is not bad considering again how long we have participated and if i remember correctly we only had around 30 or 40 dollars worth of yts and we accumulated <coughs> even at this one over here over 10 bucks and again if we would have put in way more we would have made better returns but that's what i mean you can even do with a small amount and a good return with just yts and if we would have participated earlier in a hyperwave we could even have gotten a way better allocation and then again it would have been way more work. that's why again there's season two and you still can participate and yeah pretty much that sums it up we will again most likely have a look at it when the claim is open it has already set on the side it will most likely be in october so expect there some news uh yeah on the twitter or on the discord hope you enjoyed the, uh, the video if so make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe and also have a wonderful day or night wherever you are based and we will see us in the next video bye bye